Welcome to Art Explained, the home of art, art history, stories, and art education for all who are interested. This video is an invitation to learn about Grigory Glockman and how he contributed to modernism and post-impressionism. We invite you to watch this video until the end so you can understand how this small town artist from Vitebsk became an international figure in the art world and ended up living in Los Angeles. Gluckman was born on October 25, 1898 in the Russian town of Vitebsk. At 19, he attended the Art Academy in Moscow, but left for Berlin three years later in 1920 in order to escape the revolution. While in Berlin, he changed his name from Glickman to Gluckman. In 1924, he went to Italy for nine months where he produced many paintings. In October of 1924, he had his first one-man exhibition at the Galerie Drouet in Paris. The next year, he showed in the Salon de Tuileries, the Salon d'Atome, and the Salon National des Beaux-Arts. He had a solo Paris exhibition at Galerie Charpentier in 1934. He exhibited at Galerie Rouen with Jean Marimbert, Van Montfort, de Botton, and Le Vavasseur. While in Paris, his career soared. His paintings were positively received by the critics and sold well. During this time, he also exhibited in London and New York. He painted Parisian street scenes full of people, sensual nudes, and Parisian nightlife. He became friends with world-renowned violinist Yasha Heifetz. Heifetz was also a major collector of Gluckman's work. Grigory Gluckman knew perfectly how to blend the wave of modernism and post-impressionism with the academic portrait. In this way, the works of the skillful painter seem to become the story of a time when the beauty and discretion of women were honored, even in his delicate nudes. Gluckman preferred the company of musicians and intellectuals rather than artists. The classical painting techniques which Gluckman learned in Moscow served him well throughout his career. He painted mostly on wood panels using a layering method to apply his paint. This method was time consuming because he had to let each application dry before proceeding. The results were rich colors with depth and softness that worked well for his subjects. After the occupation of Paris by the Germans in June 1941, he fled to Nice, France, and married Anna Sorokovich. They immigrated to New York in 1941 and moved to Los Angeles, California in 1945. He began exhibiting his paintings at the Dalzell Hotfield Galleries in Los Angeles and Milch Galleries in New York. He continued to show his work there for two decades, along with many other European artists, including Pierre Sicard. In 1955, Dazel Hatfield published a book on Gluckman. Gluckman painted in Paris again, briefly in 1954, exhibiting at the Galerie Rouen David but maintained his residence in Los Angeles and eventually became an American citizen. Gluckman had a long and successful career. His works are in many museums and private collections all over the world. During his career, he also illustrated several books. He became a fellow of the Royal Society of Arts in London in 1948 and the Benjamin Franklin Society in 1968. He continued to paint until his death 
in 1973. Thank you so much for watching our video. It means the world to us. See you in the following video.